How to analyze a research article. Step-by-step -step guide. By answering list of questions. How to analyze research article titled. Effect of motivation, leadership, and organizational culture on satisfaction and employee performance written by. Paris and Pataruhu in 2020. In order to analyze research article, you must have some knowledge of research and research software. If you print the research article to read it word by word, it will waste lot of time. But if you have knowledge of research and know tips and tricks to search in PDF by pressing Ctrl and F button to search the required words given in questions to find in research article, it will save lot of time. It will skim rest of part and you will get your answer easily. Don't stuck with lengthy questions. Leave it to end first solve easy questions. You can easily find out based on research knowledge. Here a list of 14 questions to answer. You can search in research article in PDF file. Starting from journal name, to identify which null hypotheses are rejected. Why? Question number one is what is the journal name in which research article is published? The answer is. The Journal of Asian Finance, Economics and Business, is the journal name in which research article is published. Question number two is identify the references style and also cite the research article. The answer is. The authors of research article used American Psychological Association, APA style for references and the research article is cited below. Paris, M. and Pataruhu, J.R. 2020 Full stop after that you have to write title of research article in sentence form such as effect of motivation, leadership, and organizational culture on satisfaction and employee performance. After that you have to write journal name in italic style such as the Journal of Asian Finance, Economics and Business, 78, 577 to 588. Question number three is what is the type of abstract used in research article? The answer is. The type of abstract used in research article is informative abstract because the authors used 201 words. Question four is discuss the research method used in research article. The answer is. The research method used in the article is written by Paris and Pataruhu 2020 is based on structural equation modeling, SEM. The SEM is the set of statistical technique used to measure and analyze the associations of observed and latent variables Beren and Violato, 2010. In simple words, it is multivariate statistical technique that is used to analyze structural associations. This technique is the combination of confirmatory factor analysis and multiple regression analysis, and is used to analyze the structural relationship between dependent and independent variables. Paris and Pataruhu 2020 used confirmatory factor analysis CFA, for reliability analysis based on Kronbach alpha value and goodness of model fit. In CFA, the reliability analysis of all 30 items gives valid results. In addition, the authors then selected some indexes in assessing the model fit which are minimum discrepancy function by degree of freedom, root mean square error of approximation, RMSEA, goodness of fit index, adjusted goodness of fit index, competitive fit index, CFI, and Tucker-Lewis index, TLI, highly relies on the conventional cutoff values and degree of freedom, DF. All values under goodness of fit test are gives fit results except GFI and AGFI which gives moderate results. After that, the authors test the seven hypotheses based on p-value of t-test by using simple linear regression analysis. 
The result of regression analysis revealed that p-value of t-test is lower than 5% level of significance in which first 4 and 7 hypothesis gives positive and significant results which means that we will reject null hypothesis. Moreover, the fifth and sixth hypotheses gives negative and insignificant results because p-value of t-test is greater than 5% level of significance which mean that we can't reject null hypothesis. Question number five is what is the research problem in research article? The answer is, human resources must be managed properly to balance worker demands, business requirements, and the abilities of firms, Mappermeyering et al. 2020. The company must maintain this balance at all times to develop and flourish. They are expected to be efficient and responsible in their work. Cara Lampus et al. 2019. The strength and quality of the company's money or capital and its human resources management are critical to its long term viability. Stone et al. 2020. According to management, to achieve company goals, such as the development of a correct working mentality with high levels of dedication and loyalty to their work, proper guidance, direction, motivation and coordination from the leader to his subordinates are all necessary to achieve these goals, Akob et al. 2020, Herani et al. 2020, Nawian et al. 2019. It is backed by literature that leadership has a vital effect on organizational activities and is needed to improve the company's competitiveness on an ongoing basis and is suitable for subordinates which will significantly affect their performance of workers in terms of more security and projection. Than et al. 2020, Nawian et al. 2019, Suung et al. 2019, Yang and Kim, 2018. Creating job satisfaction of workers is not easy task because job satisfaction can only be created if there is continuity between work motivation, leadership, and organizational culture which can accommodate it well and accepted by all workers. A worker's sense of well-being can only is reached when the company's organizational culture is one that all employees can accept and enjoy. The individual and collective efforts of an organization's employees significantly impact its overall success. In other words, the behavior of corporate members, both as individuals and as groups, can impact organizational performance since motivation may influence organizational performance. Akob et al. 2020, Herani et al. 2020, Nawian et al. 2019. By building a work culture or corporate culture, a manager may motivate their staff to go above and beyond to attain a high level of performance. Hoang et al. 2020. A person's drive to succeed in the job is affected by internal and external factors, including recognition and attention. People who are highly skilled in their field of work are less likely to be satisfied with their jobs when they are not recognized or compensated for their efforts. According to previous research, leadership has a critical role in an organization's operations. Khan et al. 2020, Paris and Pataruhu, 2020, Raymond and Iqbal, 2020. Organizational culture is a set of basic assumptions and beliefs held by the workers of then developed and passed down to overcome external adaptation and internal integration issues. Limage and Bernroyder, 2019. Miller, 2006. Recently, the problem of corporate culture has become a real concern, especially attractive in uncertain working conditions. Meng and Berger, 2019, Stone et al., 2007. Workers are unhappy at work are less likely to do their best work because they are dissatisfied with the company. 
to what extent do motivation, leadership, and organizational culture can affect on satisfaction and employee performance? Question number six is what is the research problem in research article? The answer is, it is not thesis because in research article authors just focus on overall research question and research objective that is. What is effect of motivation, leadership, and organizational culture on satisfaction and employee performance is the research question. While to investigate the effect of motivation, leadership, and organizational culture on satisfaction and employee performance is the research objective of research article. Question number seven is what is research type, research approach? The answer is, the research type is qualitative research and research approach is inductive research. Question number eight is what are the variables used in the study? Mention the types. The answer is, there are five variables i.e. motivation, leadership, organizational culture, job satisfaction and performance are used in the study. The first three variables used in this study are independent variables while work or job satisfaction and performance are dependent variables. The list of variables are mentioned in summary table which is given in next slide based on alternative hypotheses. Here is the summary table of dependent and independent variables. You can easily find the dependent and independent variable from hypotheses given in research article. It is important tip that variables that comes in last in research hypothesis is dependent variable or after preposition. On. Question number nine is identify the null and alternative research hypotheses. To answer this question there are seven research hypotheses in research article which are given as under. Null hypothesis H0 is. Motivation has a negative and insignificant effect on job satisfaction while alternative hypothesis H1 is motivation has a positive and significant effect on job satisfaction. Null hypothesis H0 is, motivation has a negative and insignificant effect on performance while hypothesis H2 is motivation has a positive and significant effect on performance. Null hypothesis H0 is, leadership has a negative and insignificant effect on job satisfaction while hypothesis H3 is leadership has a positive and significant effect on job satisfaction. Null hypothesis H0 is, leadership has a negative and insignificant effect on performance while hypothesis H4 is leadership has a positive and significant effect on performance. Null hypothesis H0 is, organizational culture has a negative and insignificant effect on job satisfaction while hypothesis H5 is organizational culture has a positive and significant effect on job satisfaction. Null hypothesis H0 is, organizational culture has a negative and insignificant effect on performance while hypothesis H6 is organizational culture has a positive and significant effect on performance. Null hypothesis H0 is, job satisfaction has a negative and insignificant effect on performance while hypothesis H7 is job satisfaction has a positive and significant effect on performance. Question number 10 is what is the research strategy, study setting, unit of analysis, time horizon and research design used in research articles? To answer this question, the research strategy of this study is based on survey to conduct research in Wahana Resources Limited North Serum District, Central Maluku Regency, Indonesia. The study setting is non-contrived field study. The unit of analysis is individual i.e. worker of Wahana Resources Limited North Serum District. Time horizon of this study is cross-sectional study. 
Type of investigation is hypotheses testing and descriptive correlational study and research design is based on questionnaires. Question number 11 is, what is population, sample size and sample technique of study? To answer this question, the population of the study is based on all workers of Wahana Resources Limited North Serum District, Central Maluku Regency, Indonesia. In addition, the researchers stated that all workers of Wahana Resources Limited, North Serum District, Central Maluku Regency, Indonesia are 430 in which permanent workers are 244 and non-permanent workers are 186. The sample size are 155 workers of Wahana Resources Limited North Serum District and the sample technique is based on proportionate stratified random sampling as used by Puiz and Pataruhu in 2020. Question number 12 is identify scale, items used for variables and research software. To answer this question, the scale used in research article is 5-point Likert scale based on 5 points. 1 is for strongly disagree, 2 is for disagree, 3 is for neither agree nor disagree, 4 is for agree and 5 is for strongly agree. The items used for job satisfaction are 7 and performance are also 7. The items for independent variables such as motivation, leadership and organizational culture are 6, 6 and 4, respectively. Thus, total items are 30. The research software used in research article is the analysis of moment structures, AMOS. Question number 13 is, identify type of data and how is the data collected in research article? To answer this question, the type of data is primary data and the data is collected from 155 respondents through questionnaires during period from April to December 2009. The researchers set items for dependent and independent variables which are list of 30 questions to measure all variables then select a 5-point Likert scale. By setting items of dependent and independent variables, the researcher collect the primary data and enter data into MS Excel to store it and then export data into AMOS for structural equation modeling SEM to test the data validity and reliability by conducting confirmatory factor analysis CFA, goodness of fit of model and also perform hypotheses testing by fulfilling research question and objective. Question number 14 is identify which null hypotheses are accepted or rejected. To answer this question, here all the null hypotheses are rejected because of positive and significant of impact except hypotheses 5 and hypothesis 6 in which we can't reject null hypotheses because of the p-value is greater than 5% level of significance in hypothesis 5 which is 0 0.3190. In hypothesis 6, p-value is less than 5% but have negative impact. So, in hypothesis 6 the results are negative and significant which cannot support alterative hypothesis that's why we cannot reject H not in favor of H6. Kindly subscribe my YouTube channel Thesis Helper thanks for watching.